It's a sign of the season and an Idaho tradition. The semi-annual sheep crossing at Highway 55. Photojournalist Lindsay Williams was there to watch as roughly 1,600 ewes made their transit. This was 1,600 ewes, um, mother sheep crossing Idaho 55 at Beacon Light. And uh, they're headed back home to the home ranch in Wilder, Idaho. The herders are with the sheep 24-7. Uh, they, they're from Peru mostly. They totally know how to handle the sheep and uh, enjoy the lonely life of being out with the sheep. It's just really been catching on here at this crossing, an eagle, and people love to see the sheep, you know? Well, it's always fun to come and see the sheep. I mean, it's, it's an event in a neighborhood that doesn't have a lot of events. You know, this has been going on since the late 1880s. Started with Andy Little, our governor's uh, great grandfather from Emmett, Idaho. I think because it's kind of historic, they've done it for a long time, and it's kind of traditional. It's a part of culture you don't get other places necessarily. I wear wool. <laughs> I lived in a city. <laughs> you know, we have thousands of new people that have moved to Idaho, and, and a lot of them have never seen anything like this in their life. And they're like, wow, this is why we moved to Idaho. I think it ties us to the area. I mean, it's kind of what there is in Idaho. It ties you to history. And it ties into the bass culture, which is important here. It's just really fun to see all these sheep. You don't, you don't get to see those. So it's, a, it's something really different. They'll be grazing on alfalfa fields on their way home. And then uh, by January, uh, the ewes will be having newborn lambs and starting the, the whole cycle over again. Everyone is just great about sharing our public lands with livestock and, and sheep. We can all get along. There's enough space for all of us. 